While Michigan's economy is still trying to come back from a pandemic that still challenges recovery, one of Governor Whitmer's department heads is very optimistic about one sector of that economy, and that is the agriculture. Political reporter Rick Alvin caught up with the director of the Michigan Department of Agriculture and Rural Development to talk about ag's place in Michigan's economy. Rick. Director Gary McDowell is a farmer himself, former member of the State House from the UP, and his travels in West Michigan today included visiting the Andy Mast Greenhouse. While taking a tour with the owner, the two talked about how greenhouse growers have made big strides in reducing electricity use and recycling rainwater to make the process more eco-friendly and more cost-efficient, too. After looking at the facility, McDowell talked to me about the general state of agriculture and what he hopes is its future. Most people, when they think of Michigan, they think of cars, manufacturing, but Michigan is an agricultural powerhouse. $104.7 billion last year that food and ag contributed to Michigan's economy. 805,000 people are employed in food and ag in Michigan. And this is a good example of Michigan agriculture. We have over 300 commodities that are produced in Michigan and sold. And it's not just in Michigan where they're sold. We're a global powerhouse actually we have two billion dollars last year in exports director mcdowell says that despite the good numbers the pandemic contributed in a trend that already existed where rural and agricultural areas are falling behind he says governor whitmer is establishing the department of rural development that will focus exclusively on identifying and providing solutions in rural areas across the state